Hello, it's Kate here, mynaturalhappiness.com, Reading School of Reiki, helping you go from hamster wheel to happiness. I hope you're well, and I hope you've had the most amazing week. So I wanted to say hi and see how you are, and also to say, you know, it's just coming up to the mid, well, we've just passed the midway point of the year, and at the start of the year, a lot of people tend to put in New Year's resolutions and plans and think about where you're at and what's going on. And we are in Harvest Festival time and we are at the time where we are harvesting what we sowed at the start of the year. And I wanted to just say, are you happy with what you've sowed? Are you happy with what you've achieved? What have you achieved? Give yourself credit for what you have achieved. And if you had this time again, what would you do differently? It's something that having those stop points in the year to stop and think about what has gone well, what hasn't gone well, If we had the time again, what would we do differently? That is so powerful and has helped me achieve achieve more than I ever dreamt possible. Part of the tools and techniques that I work with to get there. And the reason I wanted to say that is because the seeds of change program has launched has started and I'm working with some incredible incredible people to help them achieve what it is that they're wanting to achieve their goals their dreams their wishes and this is one of the tools that we'll be working with as well as really being mindful and purposeful about what we are sowing What are we wanting to achieve? By stopping and taking that time, putting a plan in place and having accountability, having a point to come back to time after time after time and say, I did that or I didn't do that. I have somebody I speak to every working day where... I say the day before, this is what I'm going to do, this is what I've done, this is what I'm going to do tomorrow. And that accountability really makes a difference, really makes a difference, because I don't want to jump on that call and say, you know what, I didn't do it. And that's what the Seeds of Change is about. It's about creating that community so that you've got that accountability, focus, dedication, help to find what it is that you're wanting to do, time to meditate. It's part of the course to stop and think about what it is that you really want to be doing. Where do you want to be in a year's time, five years' time, ten years' time? What do you want to have achieved? And it's amazing to... Create that space for others to create their happiness. Create that space for and framework for others to achieve their goals, dreams and wishes. And it may speak to you to join the programme, it may not. But I just wanted to jump on and just say, are you happy? If not, what would you do differently? What can you do differently? And where do you want to be in a year from now? And if you did three things towards that goal every single working day, where would you be in a year? And if you didn't, where would you be? And just have a think about that. It may be that it speaks to you to contact me for the Seeds of Change programme. And it may be that it speaks to you to contact someone else. And it may be that it speaks to you to just focus on things. 
in the moment, in the now. I know I couldn't do it on my own because having that outside support helps. And so I'm creating that for others in line, in tune with the seasons, with the Celtic wheel of the year, because that's what I do and that's the framework that I work with to work on an energetic level up while taking practical steps to get there. And I know it took me having outside help and so I know it's going to take others to have outside work. If you're self-motivated, then I'm wow. <laughs> I'm watching you saying Bolt. I don't know if I've really watched I Am Bolt and you saying Bolt saying, you know, he was concerned by at this point in his career, he still needs outside motivation. He's still not self-motivated. And his coach was there saying sometimes it takes a gear shift. It was incredible because I was like, wow, even you saying Bolt needs the help. Wow. And uh, yeah, it's really powerful, really powerful. So whether it's self-motivation that's getting you through at the moment, someone else or me, I just wanted to say, where do you think you'll be in a year's time? And what can you do today to achieve that goal? That's how I went self-employed. That's how I lost over four and a half stone. That's how I got myself walking. After I had the car accident, I could barely walk. I took it literally one step at a time until I am getting there. And I'm still working on it and I'm still very, very aware that everything is one day at a time. Everything is one day at a time. I take nothing for granted, which is why I do things daily to achieve where, what I want to do when I in a year, two years, three years, I'm always, always, always working on myself, on my business as well as in my business. I still have it's over there somewhere my uh, planner, daily planner that I do a journal, pretend it's a daily journal for. Slimming well because I know I can't do it on my own. I still go to the meetings every week because I know I need outside help. I know that's who I am. And uh, so I've, I work with that and it has created amazing, amazing, amazing changes. So, yeah, just thinking, just really wanted to say, where do you want to be in a year's time? And what are you going to do today to get there? It's a thought provoking question. So, let me know your goals, dreams and wishes. Let me know what you, you don't have to join, you don't, you know, it's not about that, it's about sharing that dream with others to make it real. Because when you speak it, when you say it, when you put it out there, you're sending a message to the universe that that's what you want. And the universe will find ways to help you. So it's not about joining, it's not about telling me it's about saying it to someone, saying it to the universe. So keep me posted. Let me know what your dreams, wishes are. It'll be exciting to hear what everybody wants to do. Ah, so looking forward to hearing from you so much. Looking forward to hearing what three things you're going to do today to get there. I'm excited for you. I'm excited because it's amazing when we start working with our true potential our true soul purpose it's amazing looking forward to hearing you with kate with love with love kate mynaturalhappiness.com reading school of reiki helping you go from hamster to happiness have the most amazing amazing day with so much love